What's up everyone? Welcome back to the Durbin Compound. If you haven't met me already, my name is Devin Durbin. So today on the channel, we are replacing wiper blades on the W205. I had a recent request from uh, subscribers and people in the comments to do more Mercedes videos. So we're going to do a little quick video on how to change windshield wipers. So if you're interested, stay tuned. All right guys, so this is a very, very simple process. I think it's more simple, they're simpler than uh, a lot of other car manufacturers. So the only thing you need to do is you need to make sure the wipers are in the up position. I'm about to show you how to do it now. Now the reason you wanna do that is, let's flip the camera around, I'll show you exactly what I'm talking about. All right, so on these Mercedes cars here, uh, a lot of them, you, you cannot lift the wiper arms. They hit the, uh, they hit the hood. So previous owners and stuff I've seen uh, have actually hit the hood with the wiper arms. So what we're going to do is going to get inside the car. I'll show you how to put the wipers in the up position in order to uh, service these. All right, guys. So we're sitting in the vehicle, um, vroom, vroom. We are, what we're going to do is we're going to turn on our accessories to the second, uh, second position. So one and then number two. So all of our accessories are on. Don't mind the service B. We're about to carry that out. All right, so, oh, look at me, low fuel tank as well. What, I'm batting a thousand. All right, so what you wanna do is over here on your windshield wipers, um, you're gonna hit the mist button. You hit that button and it will allow your, uh, allow your wipers to come up on the windshield. And as soon as they do that, you hit the off button or the engine start button or whatever, you turn the key to the off position. So I'm gonna to attempt to do it really quickly. Um, so I hit the button and then you're gonna turn off the car by hitting the engine start stop button or turning your key to off position. So the wipers come up and you turn off the car just like that. So now the wipers are in the up position and we can work on them. All right guys, so now you can see that the wipers can come all the way up without hitting the hood part. Now remember to put the wipers back down on the windshield before you turn the car back on because it will send these right into the lip here on the hood. So don't be a dummy, uh, make sure you're good here. Okay, so I'm gonna come up here to this mechanism, move you around a little bit, try to see this. Okay, what you need to do in order to get this windshield wiper off is extremely easy. You literally just hold it out like this and it allows this little uh, this little clip to slide it to the up position just like that and the wiper pops off I think it's easier than any other car that's that is around you literally just slide it in and then slide this piece back down on um, Not a lot of people are doing such a simple design now um, Let's just put new wiper blades on I don't have anything else to say Okay, when putting these blades on, there is a uh, kind of a ramp here. If you see this, uh, it looks like a half pipe here. Um, then there is a side that is really square. Hopefully you can see that. Okay, you want the ramp side on the wind side. So you want wind to come across the windshield and then up on that ramp. So just remember that that's how you orient it. Um, you can also make sure that the sticker is in the up position. So go ahead and slide our wiper blade in here and then click our lock back into place and we're ready to rock and roll. Easy as that. All right, we're gonna put that back down on the windshield and on to the next one. All right guys, as simple as that, changing the wipers is not a big deal. Um, I would recommend that you uh, clean the windshield because as you can see, I have the new wipers in the up position. As soon as I turn the car on, they will go back down into uh, underneath the hood. So you're gonna rake any dirt, trash, grease, grime, whatever is on the windshield, you're gonna rake that right under your new blades. So ensure that your, your um, windshield is very clean. Um, it was kind of problematic for the video and I got a lot of glare, but it needs to be clean to make sure that you're not uh, rubbing that dirt right into the wiper. So if you, if you want to know the part number of the kit I used, they're about $75. Um, 
I got the kit from the dealer. They're the best wipers to go to. I would not go to um, AutoZone or Advanced Auto or Riley's or whatever. I would not go there and get their wipers. They don't last as long. This set has lasted me uh, almost three years now. So you can just imagine um, a regular wiper from somewhere, $20 a piece. You're into it about $40. So and those wipers may just last you a season. They're very crappy, they wear out very fast. Um, the 75 bucks that I spend on these and they wipe the windshield amazingly. Um, they're designed specifically for the car and they have lasted me, yeah, almost three years. So um, I highly recommend the wipers from the dealer. Just suck it up and get the Mercedes wipers. Um, get their inserts. I'll roll in a part number here on the box. Um, if you're looking at the 205, um, so the C-Class uh, new 2015 to 2019, I guess, is the uh, W205. So if you're looking at it, get the wipers and uh, just suck it up once, cry once. And uh, that's all it is to the video. So I hope you guys learned something today. I hope to see you guys click subscribe. If you like value in my content, give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down, whatever you're into. And we'll see you guys in the next video.